Hello there, I'm John Dodd, a volunteer at the museum, and I'm going to be talking about this poster from 1933, um, Today in Comfort by Greenline Coach. The artworks dominated by four well-matched white horses pulling a private carriage, or perhaps it's a male coach. The coach is turning sharply to the right, giving us a good view of all for animals. Now we can't, we'll come back to the artwork, but next I want to look at the text beneath. Right beneath the artwork we see a rhyming couplet that evokes the pleasure of travelling to some exciting destination. And the slogan below the rhyme suggests that in modern times, that is 1933 when this poster was issued, that the same kind of pleasure can be achieved by travelling on one of London Transport's comfortable, handsome Green Line coaches. Green Lines were London Transport's long distance express bus services. The coach routes often connected two towns lying either side of London. For example, the second coach you see runs from Uxbridge to Great Bookham in Surrey. I chose to talk about this poster because it displays the LPTB logo which only appears on a few posters during 1933. It was soon abandoned, replaced by the more familiar bar and circle logo already familiar to Londoners and still in use today. The London Passenger Transport Board was created at the instigation of the government in July of 1933. It took responsibility for all public transport except the mainline railways in London and in its surrounding counties. This included the underground, all the buses and all the trams in the area. Returning to the picture, we can see that the artist's name is Jean Dupin, a notable French artist who decorated steamships and adorned the walls of churches, as well as illustrating fashion journals. The artwork is constructed from a black outline drawing, which is then coloured in shades of brown, green and red. The men in red on top of the coach could be post office employees, guarding the mailbox with weaponry and warning slower traffic to move over by blowing their horn. A surprising feature of this illustration is the young woman in the foreground, joyously running alongside the coach and thus displaying Dupas's talents as a fashion illustrator. I hope you've enjoyed hearing about this particular poster, but if you want to know about further posters, take a look at the museum's website where pretty much all the poster collection is on show. Also, follow what's going on at the London Transport Museum on social media and in the future, I hope to see you at the Acton Depot or the Museum at Covent Garden. Thanks.